A lot of people snapping pics, putting them up on social media. Take your time if you're out and about. Yes, be very careful. There are some school delays. Cool weather, Jess, please. Heavy rain today, isolated showers. After that, pockets of sunshine, hopefully later on this afternoon. Breezy. Highs around 60 right now. The temps will, thr- uh, will drop later on throughout the day. All right, so we are getting ready for Slam Dunk to the Beach. Yeah, we are. You know, we've been a part of the Slam Dunk to the Beach for quite a few years now. Goes on between Christmas and New Year's. Huge, huge basketball tournament at Cape Henlope. And Jess, get all the details. Yeah, December the 26th through the 29th at Cape High in Lewis. If you want to check out the complete schedule for all the games, just go to slamdunktothebeach.com. But we're going to kick off the event here on Tuesday, the 26th, the day after Christmas at 6 p.m. The Cape Henlopen High School girls are taking on Our Lady of Mount Carmel out of Maryland. And at 7.15, the Cape boys will face Caraval Academy out of Delaware. You can watch all the action, and you can also uh, listen to the action right here on Power 1017 with Anthony Joseph. Yes, again, right here. Check out all the action. Uh, the local teams go Cape. Yep. We got a phone check coming up next with Clarissa Jenkins. Good morning, Power 1017. Jessica, good morning, girlfriend. How you doing? Adil! Bill, 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 before you say it, I know I'm live on the air, so watch my mouth. I know already. (laughs) Yeah, watch your mouth. Hey, we can't do it like we do on the podcast, Angel. I, I know, I know, and you and, and that's messed up because you you knew I didn't know what I was doing on the podcast, and I couldn't even hang up, and you just started study laughing at me, bro. That wasn't fair. <laughs> that was terrible, Bill. Angel, when do you know what you're doing? Come on. <laughs> that's oh, messed that really up. Was, well, that is messed Isn't up. Isn't that jacked up? It is, man. He, yo, he had me looking like a fool on the podcast, man. No. Hey, that, that was good. Up. Angel, that was good stuff. That was good stuff this weekend. That was good stuff, yeah. Yeah, so I, I, I've kind of always do. Yeah, I've kind of revived my podcast. I think uh, the, the title of the show for this past weekend, uh, Bill Baker Live on my IG at Bill Baker two four two three. The title is "Is this the show?" Because I didn't <laughs> know. I, I just went on live. And- is this it? You got- you got to have me on there every week, bro. It is, it is the show, bro. We'll, we'll boost up that show with my potty ass mouth. Yeah, um, well, we'll see. We'll, we'll see. Don't get too excited. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Don't get carried away, funny. Angel. <laughs> That's funny. Jessica, I have a question for you, Jessica. What's up? You went to Puerto Rico, and you did Did you bring me back something? Because I told Tad would to tell you to bring me some pasteles or bring me a little bit of sand in a bottle, anything like that. I have nothing? some sand in a bottle, and I have seashells. Oh, okay. Did you bring me one? No pasteles, though. They don't allow you to bring those back home anymore. No, they don't. Oh, they stopped that then. Oh, yep. Yeah. How about, oh, you know what I was telling Bill about Coquito? Do you haven't you have introduced Bill to Coquito? No, I don't think he knows about Coquito. <laughs> he, does, he doesn't because we were talking about it on his podcast. And he's like, no, I never had Coquito. And I was like, Jessica never introduced you to that? It's like, like Puerto oh, Rican no, eggnog. Okay. Yeah, no, I like, I I, hey, and, and, and you talked about it. She talked about it before. I do like that. So yeah, that's eggnog, but it's Puerto Rican style. But it's I'm gonna real, get him lit. Good. Hey, you know what? Hey, I, hey, I'm all, I'm all for it. It sounds good to me. I'm gonna get him lit on the air. You should, man. Oh God, if you do that, when I tell you what, I'm gonna have the best time of my life. <laughs> <laughs> right. I want to hear him stumbling his words. Hey, Angel. His words. Yeah, look for me on IG, Angel. I will, I will. Every time you hit it up or you post it, but I'm going to look for you, but definitely. You know, yeah. you know me, I'm a supporter. Bro. Yeah, no, no, hey, I appreciate that. Yeah, so just for everybody, you know, like I said, at Bill Baker 2423 kind of, you know, possibly reviving the podcast a little bit. And, uh, you know, yeah. I, I want to have everybody on, as many people as That's possible. Awesome. Listen, bro, you know me. I'm a big time supporter of your of your show, bro. I'm a P1 since day one. You know that, bro. Hey, listen, I, I'm I'm right there with you, bro. You're the man. You're the man. We love you, Angel. You have a great you, day, bro. buddy. Love you, Angel. You too, guys. Enjoy your day. Bye. All right, very good. There he goes, Angel P1 listener. It's 829. It's Bill and Jessica show. Time now for a phone check with Larissa Jenkins. Hello. Time for another phone check. For real. Clarissa Jenkins. Hello. Hi, Miss Shepard? Yes. Hi, Kavina Durant from Carnival Cruise Line calling in regards to a letter we received. Yes. 
Yes. What was your request now? You want to be on the newer ship, not on the old ship? I was trying to be on the newer ship because my family, it was my family's first time uh, cruising. So I wanted them to get the best experience, which I felt would be on the, on the, the newer ship. Okay. I was trying to get you on there, but I ran into an issue with the uh, the TMDK initiative. How many how many children are you bringing on the ship with you? How many kids are there, you guys? Can you add it up for me real quick? Hurry up. I think it's 10 kids. That kind of goes against the TMDK initiative that we just passed for the ships. What is that? Uh, the Too Many Damn Kids. Too Many Damn Kids? Well, it, it, there's too many children on board. That's just like a lack of a better term. I'm telling you. Ma'am? Uh, well, as a, as, I'm kind of shocked that you would use that term, being a professional, and lack of a better term is not good enough for me. Understand. Ma'am? Yes. I'm sorry. Uh, it sounds like there's some ruckus going on there. If you want, we can call back at a better time. I can't imagine someone from Carnival calling me and speaking to me that way. Well, I just cannot imagine... This ain't quite a while. Y'all not lying to me. Ma'am, I was just trying to be, I was trying to be jovial. Oh, okay. But, that, I mean, basically what it is, when you have a certain amount of kids over the limit, we can't put them on the newer ship. Okay, and why can't kids, more than 10 kids, be on one new ship? Because there's too many damn kids. But that's not a, a necessarily an adult ship. That's a family ship. I've been on that ship before. No, understand, it is a family ship, but when you have that many kids, that's when they, you know... Okay, so bottom line, you're telling me that we can't do it because there's too many kids. Correct, but there is something I can do for you. What can you do? I can tell you that you've just been phone-checked courtesy of your family. What you going to do? What? Did I need to you kidding me? On the radio. Oh, you've just been phone-checked.